Hello everyone. Welcome to Educative Newsroom. We are coming to look at how to look for jobs on the websites of international organizations. In fact, if you dream about working with any international organization, we are coming to show you how to look for job from them. These are institutions that would hardly take bribe. They don't actually take bribe to the best of our knowledge before recruitment. So when you are applying, you are applying based on your merits. You are applying based on your merits. So can we take this episode very seriously whilst we go into the process in your search for job. The website that we are going to use for this uh, practical is uh, UNESCO. UNESCO. So let's see how we got here. If you can, uh, you can see here, there are so many jobs opening here for different countries anyway. So we have France, Uzbekistan, Peru, Bangladesh, Congo, Republic, Gabon, France, Panama, and the rest. But if you are looking for a job from any international organization, what do you do? Or how do you get onto pages like this? Let's start from the scratch. So first, you go into your Google. You would have a particular international organization in mind at the time you are going to Google. So in our case, we are going to UNESCO official website. It's already there, so pick it up. Remember, you must always look for the official website because the truth is that some website can be cloned. Clone means they uh, they design the website to look as if it's original, but it's not original. We can call it a fake. So you must look for the official. You must add official to it to get it. So let's enter into the the official UNESCO website. As it's opening, kindly subscribe for the next episode because we are going to be looking at other ones as well. Now that we are on the UNESCO website. You must be here because of something. So that is for job. So the best thing to do is to go into their menu, which is the three short dot line on top there. We picked it. So now that we are here, we have expertise, impact, publication and data, get involved, search. So in this case, expertise we have been talking about uh, the expertise of UNESCO itself, the impact they have, they have been making, their publication and their data about what they do our best place to get the job we want is get involved so let's go into get involved so now that we are in the get involved there are so many things here there are so many ways to take unesco with there are so many ways to take action with unesco everyone can make a difference join us and leave your mark so we have uh, spread the word become a partner join unesco donate we are looking for jobs, so our best bet is join UNESCO. But if you are a first timer doing something like this, in fact, you must be ready to go into any part of the website just to explore, because you may not know what exactly looking for. Good. So now we are on the join us page. So when you scroll down, you will notice that we have seen career categories. So you can even look for your job according to the categories of job you want, or you can look for it. Uh, just the general job openings good just uh, for curiosity sake let's see what are the down here so we are down we have the facebook page we are twitter youtube instagram and linkedin when you have pages like this it's better you just click on them and go and follow these pages because you can confirm that these are the official websites so that any time maybe you don't even remember to come to unesco page but you're on facebook you may see their post there you're on linkedin you are on uh, youtube you can get their post there so let's go back to what we actually doing here. Now we let's go to the C jobs or job opening C. Good. So now that we are here, this is the general page where all the jobs are located. France, we have Uzbekistan, we have Peru, we have Bangladesh, we have Congo, Gabon, France again, Panama, Costa Rica, Kazakhstan. Um, other ones, multiple, multiple jobs, multiple ones like that, it means they're in the various countries. So now, when you look at the menu here, we can actually set job by keyword, maybe internship, scholarship. So let's just, uh, which one should we pick first? We can pick by keyword, let's go by internship. 
Good. So now that we have taken internship like this, search. So it's asking that there's currently no internship there. Let's look at volunteering. Volunteer. Good. So we can see some volunteer job uh, volunteer job added down here. Well, uh, this one internship attached to it. Communication and public engagement, multiple locations. Uh, Bureau of Human Resources. Multiple locations like that means that they are in all the uh, country offices. All the country offices. Good. So now that we are done with this, let's we can also pick by country. So let's pick a country like Ghana. Good. So Ghana, we have one, one job currently is available. Associate National Administrative Officer is available. So if you're interested, you can just go and apply there. Now let's take another country and see. Uganda. So picking Uganda, there are currently no job. When you have no, no nothing there like that, it doesn't mean there will never be. Probably the following week or even tomorrow, they could post another job there. So it is your duty to be going there every day or every other week. It is the reason why it's good you follow them on their social media platform so that even if you don't remember to come here, you can see them elsewhere. It is not only UNESCO you can do this thing for. You can do it for UN itself, uh, UNICEF, any major institution that you can think about. You can find them there. So let's look at uh, all the jobs available again. So when you have jobs available like this, you can just pick any of them and see what it entails. So let's take this internship um, office of the director general, communication information sector. So we can pick this one and look at the content. Good. So that's the top is the overview. Duty station is headquarters, field offices and institutes like we have mentioned means it's scattered across the across the world and you have all that you may be looking out for so guys these are the ways you want to look out uh, you want to look for a job from any international organization this is what to do i could have done this thing for another institution like a uh, un itself so let's go into un united nations United Nations official website. So we can have it's on top there un.org. So when even the job is attached with it, so something like this, you see job UN careers, you can even pick the careers from here direct without even visiting the general website before rerouting yourself to the job session. So, if you are looking for a job, you, you won't just sit down. On this page, you can also search by category, search by network, search by department, search by duty stations. So, in short, these are the jobs, the way you look for jobs from various institutions. The way you look for jobs from various institutions. So, you can search your keywords there. And there are so many multiple jobs available here. Kindly subscribe for the next episode on how to get your job as early as possible. Remember, you must look for a, you must apply for a job once a week in order to get a job within six months. Have a good time. Bye.